Welcome lads to a brand new video today. This is uh, obviously Studley Fan TV, the home of all Studley uh, FC games and uh, obviously we always like to be here for a pre-season match against Cradley Town, uh, obviously away in Cradley. Uh, this is, I think we played in the first season, the MJPL, that we uh, that we beat three goals to one, but they are now in the, in the JPL. So this is going to be an even tougher uh, test on our hands and uh, I'm very much looking forward to this game and I'm sure most of you at home are as well. But I uh, didn't get off to the great grace of starts. Well, I'm not really surprised anymore that we are we're losing one nil already. Um, wouldn't lie, it is time for a change. Uh, we need some some fresh blood in the club, especially from the owners who uh, aren't splashing the cash at the moment, and uh, it's been really uh, dismal to to say the least. Anyway, Kai smothers the ball up, although he drops it a few times. But uh, we, in the end, we do get away with murder there. Here's Clements coming forward with the ball on his right foot. Uh, obviously, best player in the MJPL. But uh, yeah, he did get bodied there. Uh, unfortunately, that's one thing he has to work on, that is strength. <laughs> you serious? So I hope you enjoyed them little bit of clips here that I've managed to gather together. Um, hopefully not offending anyone in the process, but uh, we win back the ball here from Harry Bradley, and then George Skelton does the rest. And that that you just saw is the scenes back at Studley the Beehive in the bar area. Wow, what can I say? Well, Les has killed someone there again. Another one has been uh, has bit the dust there. And uh, you, you, well, here's a fun fact: you can't make shambles without the Les part of it. Um, obviously, has to have Les in there, and obviously Les is a part, a big part of that shambles unit. Uh, I am sorry, Les, but uh, we had to put that one in. Anyway, here is George Skelton who lobs the keeper. And it's a brilliant finish by George, but uh, it was very se selfish by George there. Clements was running next to him and he decided to go for goal himself and rather than not give Clements the goal. And, you know, that was very selfish from that uh, from George there. I'm, I'm going to have words with him in the change rooms after the game as Ethan Clements gets uh, absolutely obliterated by that guy. Gazumped is the word I would use to describe that uh, manoeuvre. Anyway, Les loses the ball and now there could be in here. No, Brandon saved us. Um, and anyway, it's an indirect free kick after Kai rather messed that one up after it being a pass back. Um, obviously, it was a pass back. I don't know why Kai didn't just head it away, really. Bruh. Oh, and that's a penalty if I see one. I think that was Ben or something. You got absolutely slaughtered there. Oh, well done. Well, that wasn't great from George, but obviously, he has done stuff in this game already that. Uh, has impressed the viewers that I'm watching. Clements dinks it towards George. And now here's Harry Bradley. Uh, they messes it up and he loses the ball. Um, maybe Harry Bradley, is, it, it's time to leave for him. Uh, maybe he could be leaving the role of Cam of Studley and maybe he could give that role um, to someone else. Um, uh, I don't know who, but uh, anyway, we'll just move on. Uh, Actually, there are a few fun facts that I would like to share with you. That uh, we've lost Regan and, and Maka, who are both uh, Regan's in prison for killing someone, whilst Maka um, has signed for a new club in Badgers FC, so he won't be a part of the club from uh, now on. And uh, Phil might be leaving as well. <laughs> Well, I couldn't, couldn't agree more with that uh, laugh there. That was uh, very abysmal from that uh, red and black player uh, there. But uh, anyway, the second half begins and Clemps has been brought off. Um, you know, just because a bit of rotation, we're winning the game. We're, we're clearly in front, so just give him a bit of rotation. He's, uh, he's, he's clearly the best player in the team. Um, obviously, he's he obviously is the best player in the team. So I uh, don't want any mean comments, please. Um, only nice comments. Um, Thank you, really the only nice comments I get uh, all day is, is, is from uh, 
It's from the missus and uh, and my mum. So uh, if you could just uh, give me some nice comments, that'd be great. Because uh, obviously uh, my dad doesn't uh, help me out on that occasion. Every time I uh, give the ball away, which is not very often. <laughs> uh, but anyway, if, if I do give the ball away, um, he really does have a go at me, and it ends up being a fist fight in front of the ladies anyway we carry on with the football there's a shot coming in here is there no there's not it's great defending again from the lads in blue um, anyway Barnsley has been played in and that is offside for some reason my bottom that is offside how the hell can that be offside I was standing on the bench and I was in line with it uh, not literally on the bench but you know what I mean but I was standing in line with it how was that offside <laughs> That's the second time this match Les has killed someone. Um, really, I think Les should be worrying more about going to prison than what the scoreline is in this game, as he's uh, literally obliterated him into Nani with that one, which is very not not on from him. What the hell? Well, uh, I couldn't put it better myself, really. Um, bloody hell, it is now 2-2, I think. I think it is anyway, yeah. Uh, I've lost count from the score, really, and it's now 2-2. Two -two. I'm, I'm just losing my head here. I'm losing everything apart. Uh, uh, you know, I'm losing the will to live at the moment. Harry Bradley goes for a cheeky little shot. Oh, and it's gone straight in from Harry Bradley. That was the biggest fluke goal I've ever seen. You cannot count that, Harry, as a good goal. That was utter rubbish, you cheating little... Anyway, we'll carry on. We want to keep this PG, obviously. And... Uh, That's rather embarrassing. Hope you enjoyed the clip. I, uh, I managed to gather together. Anyway, uh, they, they could be in here. Kai comes charging out. Oh, Kai's made a mess of that. And it's a shambles from back to front here. Um, and uh, I think that's Brandon's going to retrieve the ball. Yes, it is. And somehow keeps that one in. Anyway, here's Benjamin Tolly on the right hand, left hand side of the field. He then goes for the shot, Ben. Stings the, hook, um, the, the gloves of the keeper there with that one. So here we have a World Cut sitting on the side, rather resembling the players on the pitch. Pussies. Well, uh, yeah, it's uh, very some smart words there from this. And if uh, ahead of this next clip, if you are under the age of uh, 15, then you must click off this, as there is some horrible language being used. I'll try my best as I score. To Are you <coughs> so I couldn't finish my sentence there, but anyway, lucky goal. Uh, but uh, sorry if you did hear any bad language uh, or industrial language, we can only apologise for that. We don't know why the, the editor has put this in, but he, he has done. But it is now 3-3 free free and it was good. Kai's mistake, obviously, but uh, obviously like, like all great men do, they all come back um, for some more. So Kai, Kai will be back in some, uh, you know, in, in, you know uh, in, in two weeks' time. Uh, it's only one mistake, it doesn't matter, it's only friendly, no one really cares. Um, well, I say that, I bloody care, and he's cost us the game there anyway. The ball's been lofted into the air, but I believe that is now full time. It is uh, suddenly free, crowdly free. If you have liked the video, so please uh, like it and subscribe if you haven't already to really help me out on YouTube. See you in a bit, guys. Goodbye.